Do you want me to go? Sure. Hey guys, and welcome back to another Aussie Action 4x4 episode. Today, we're going to be installing a new snorkel on Max's R51 Pathfinder here. Now, obviously, you can probably hear the weather isn't great, but that's for a good cause. It's raining, and we need a snorkel for all those puddles we're going to tackle in the future. So the first step of installing a snorkel is getting a template set up so you know where you're drilling holes. Sweet, is it right there Max? Yep, so it's straight in. <laughs> <laughs> no, I need to like cut out these things, I think. Yeah, you probably need to cut yeah. the whole thing. Okay, now we need skizzers. Y'all got skizzers? Wait, I got scissors here. Are you ready? <laughs> Wait, is this not part of it? I don't know. Okay, cool. Now it's ready to install. Sweet. My toolbox is just so big. All the tools are so far away. <laughs> Your shed's pretty clean too. Got you guys. This is how it's done. This is the majestic Max Meadows. This is not how you do it. <laughs> By the way, this is not an instructional video. Um, we have no clue what we're doing. That is. 100% correct. We're just a bunch of drongos with a, with a drill. <laughs> Wait, the indicator is not the same size. The indicator's smaller. <laughs> what the heck? Nah, no, Jared did it bad. No, I did it good. Okay, where do you want the first bit of tack? Okay, what I've been told... Oh, why is it flooding in here? Oh yeah, water comes in. Oh no. Okay. <laughs> what I've been told is you work your way from the bottom up. Okay. So hang on, hang on, hang on. So get that pretty much aligned where it has to be. And then, oh, I just moved it. Oh, no. oh. Oh. Did you bring paint? Oh, no. Damn. You got some toothpaste or something? Oh, yeah. You can use any paint. Oh, okay. Because it's not going to. Oh, so just, I've got gray spray it's paint. It's just the, like, that yeah. bit that you cut. This I've got a gray spray paint. Metal. So you can put that in a cup. Is that, does that line up? Oh, baby. I think it's just because... Yeah, it should be right. So let's just give her a cut. We've measured twice, but... <laughs> no, yeah. Just... <laughs> Hang on, can you pass the snorkel, please? I'll just get a nice If you just that. cut a small hole, then you can kind of see where it goes in there. If you've got a bigger hole, then you can yeah. shake it around wherever. I was going to say, just cut it out like that. <laughs> okay, so we see where this goes. So if we match up that hole on that. Oh yeah, that'll then, that actually does. So good. that'll be like that. And then and it'll be down a bit there. more. That's, yeah. That's pretty much perfect, I reckon. That's Look, good. These, these holes up the top there line up nice. Is there even any holes Oh, that'll be up there soon. Well, I guess there's only one course for this, Max. <laughs> there's only one way to find out. <laughs> but you meant to... But how are you going to get the snorkel in if the, if the guard's there? Because you have to get the piping on, on, in, in, underneath the guard, inside. Oh, right. Yeah. Okay. I'm pretty sure there's instructions on Yeah, here. <laughs> Cut the template, fill the template. No, hang on. That doesn't work. Really. No, no, no. On the instructions for the thing that it came with. Okay, I need a screwdriver, boys. No, you need this. No. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know what's left to do other than drill. Mark. We know what to do then. Bro, it's scary. Yeah. Do you have like a, a small sword that you have to put, you have to do like holes all the way around? Yeah. Wait, that's through. Um, wait. We had. We had wait, we should have videoed. Oh wait, no, we did. Or that's were you a piece in the way of. No, no, no.
Gee. What Put are it you? in a bit further, man. That's as far as it goes. What are you? That's not even a circle. You know what's going to happen? <laughs> just, just to try the drill and see. That. <laughs> Take it off. You know. 50 50 on whether we're going to die. Oh, it's more than that. That's how the that's how she's looking pretty much. And five, four, three, two. Hi, I'm Freddie. I'm Carly. So that's how she'll sit on the car. Alright, install done. Let's go in boys. Do you reckon like put a dot a dot of paint on each of these bolts and then yeah. Heat it on. Make sure it's a big bowl as well. Otherwise, it won't work. No, nah, you need more. Need more. Is this the color of your car, Max? Not really. Mm -hmm. <laughs> it was meant to be. Why does it want a hole? Oh my god! So it goes like roughly like that. Mm -hmm. So that should be where all the bolt. Oh, I just moved it all. Well. Right, you see where? That's right. Just kind of. Oh, yeah, I mean, they're pretty much all on point. Yeah. Again. Like, I moved that one over a little bit, that one over a touch, that one just like... We've committed now, boys! <laughs> Good stuff. Take it off. Before we get too, yeah. like, worried about the holes not being the right spot. <laughs> <laughs> out of sight, out of mind. Yep, I mean, sure, but... Oh, I probably shouldn't destroy the template, though. Okay, why the heck are these two not going in? So you didn't do it properly. You didn't measure it. You might just need to shove it a little bit harder. We really did measure once. We'll get a big... Like 500 times. Alright, so now I'm just grabbing out all of the nuts from our little goodie bag. And then these will hold the snorkel on. Right, hang on, I forgot one of the nuts. <laughs> All right, so now that we have the four nuts, we're going to go underneath inside the fender well and bolt them straight on. What did we forget, Max? I forgot to paint all the bare metal to stop it from rusting. So what are we going to do? Take it all off again. <laughs> you got cold. <laughs> And the next step is install the ram head. And she's good to go. Do you have to tighten it? Alright, so it is now the next day, as you can tell by the sunlight. Um, we are going to be doing all the intake piping inside the car, and the first step is to pull out the airbox. That pipe is not loose. How does it come off here? Uh -huh. Alright, so now that we've got the standard pipes taken off the airbox, we can fit the new silicone pipe and put it back into place. I'm just unbolting the snorkel so that we can get it off and get the plastic intake pipe over the hole. To put it in the wrong spot. Oh. <laughs> I 
because that is supposed to go under here and then that presses inside of it except it's like there's not enough room inside the fender yeah. what about that way <laughs> top and bottom is like nearly okay guys for watching Aussie Action's first ever snorkel install. Of course, it had to be on the Mighty Pathfinder. Also, let us know what you thought of this more vlog type style video I tried out this week. It's, you know, I thought it was turned out pretty cool and had a bit more funny moments that you can just kick back and laugh to. But you may have noticed that we skipped last week's upload. That is because we're going down to one video every two weeks, since most of us are going back to uni and all that jazz, which is going to take up our time but we are still gonna try and push this channel and try and get good content out for you, but just a little bit less so we're not fully stressed out during uni times. All right, folks, one last thing before we go. Click this link here if you wanna see our latest video. Click this one if you wanna catch up on the Pathfinder series. And why not click my face to subscribe? Aussie Action, out.